Welcome to Flowtown Fishing. Check out the all new 2022 Carolina Skiff 21 LS. I've been fishing from the bank or shoreline for decades and I've caught some pretty good fish. A few months ago, while in Port Aransas, I decided to look out across the channel from the top of the observation tower. So many places that I just can't reach from the shoreline. I want a boat, and not just any boat, a bay boat. My wife and I narrowed down our choices to three prospective boats to look at. The Mako Pro Skiff 19, the Trophy 21, and the Carolina Skiff 21 LS. First on the list, the Mako Pro Skiff 19. And this is not it. This is a 2020 Nitro bass boat. I have no interest in bass boats. It's just real pretty. I mean, real pretty. And for 70 grand, you can have one. Ooh, pretty. Now here's what I came to look at. A uh, boat that fits my tastes, which is, in this case, the Mako Pro Skiff 19. Price is 31,670 at 225 a month for about 10 years, I think. It already comes with a trolling motor a hookup, big wide deck, a few switches, a few gauges. And then over here, you have the gas tank. And I forget how much of a gas tank this is, I think the capacity is. I think it's somewhere around 27 gallons or so. It might, it might be a little, a little higher. You have cleats on each side. One here, one there, and then two on that side over there. There is not one on the front. You have some dry storage right here. And then of course, this comes with a 115 horsepower Mercury Pro XL. No jack plate, uh, just a manual adjust. It does have a stainless steel prop. This is supposed to be the, the step. When you're in the water, you can actually step up back into the boat like this. I will have yet to see if that actually works. T21 Bay by Bayliner. It's a sweet rig and I really liked it, but Karen didn't, so. I don't know, this might be out of our price range. <laughs> we'll have to wait and see. Taking a look at a Trophy 21 Bay. This is in the $40,000 range. T top. 150 horsepower. Is it Mercury? What, what is it? Yeah, Mercury. Stainless steel prop. Sweet. So, as I mentioned earlier, I only wanted a bay boat. That's the only thing that I focused on is bay boats. And my wife agrees, you know, we like to fish. So, bay boats was a thing for us. And we also wanted one of, of good size and you know, a decent size. Didn't want no 17 footer because we also have you know grown kids with their grandkids with their kids as well. So uh, we needed something uh, you know in the 20 foot range, maybe 19 foot. Then it, so it came down to the Carolina Skiff and the Mako 19. Um, we decided if we're going to spend the money on a brand new boat. Uh, yeah, we were probably going to go with the uh, Carolina Skiff, although. 
in fairness, I do have to say I kind of went back and forth for a while. I went back and forth on the idea because I, I like the price of the Mako 19, uh, but given that Mako doesn't even even make the Pro 19 skiff anymore, or the yeah the Pro Skiff 19 anymore, the choice became pretty clear with us, and we decided that we were going to buy a Carolina skiff, and we did. Things turned out the way they did. Got a great deal on, on a Carolina Skiff 21 footer and um, we brought it home. 